throw a lollipop it in the middle of the field. Bad things usually happen. It takes a strong arm guy who can right foot in there. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Buffalo touchdown. Nick Boyle, a 15 yard touchdown grab. And the Bills have taken the lead here in the fourth quarter. And touchdown and congratulations and zero relaxation ahead of them, right? Way too much time on the clock for them to start celebrating. Yeah, part one is done, but now on the sideline, you can already see them scrambling down there. They're getting those defensive guys ready. Yes, you have to get those guys ready, and you also have to talk to your special teams guys. Make sure the kickoff is exactly what you want and cover it well. Here's the Bills kickoff unit now as they will send this one away. This is fielded at the chalk of the 10. And a good return as he'll be stopped just shy of the 30-yard line. The Titan offense now working their way back onto the field. They're only in need of a field goal, a decent amount of time on the clock. So tell me if I'm wrong. You don't have to be too panicked here. No, not at all. I agree with you. And this is where your preparation and your confidence comes into play. They've worked on these situations. Yeah, they practice this all the time. They practice it all the time. They know what they want to get done. And in a lot of cases, the great competitors, they love this situation. They think they can go ahead and get it done. They practiced it. We'll see if practice makes perfect. He'll look to throw. And he will find his man on the end route. Complete. Seven yards, the pickup on the pitch and catch. And they're going to speed things up here. One of the feature points of the end route is being able to make a nice throw to the middle part of the field. Now whistles come in. We're going to get a timeout here by the offense. It's just their first. They've got two more to use here in the final stages. So just one yard to go here on third down. Back to throw. Out to the flat. That's complete to his running back. Losing two yards that time, and now it's fourth down. Really good defensive effort. They were all over that little swing pass out to the right side before Lost yarded. Terrific read, better execution, and done with a lot of enthusiasm, wasn't it? Absolutely. They saw it all the way, ran to the football, and caused a nice play for Lost Yardage. He's got curse. And he's got the first before he's brought down at the 39-yard line. Now hold everything here. We're going to get a timeout by the offense. That'll leave him with just one remaining in this fourth quarter of play. He's back to throw. Now a desperation throw deep downfield. And incomplete. He dropped it in the end zone. I'm not quite sure how he wasn't able to hold on to that one in the end zone. A great opportunity lost, but a lot of relief for the defensive guys. When they get into film next week, they're going to want to know what happened. Where was the breakdown that almost allowed a touchdown? Complete out right to Kurz. Four yards on the completion, and it sets up a third down. Seventh play of the drive upcoming here on third and six. And now it looks like they're going to be in the hurry up. Back to throw. A hit as he throws there incomplete. Well, that plays a statistic that's going to go on the defensive team stat sheet. Won't necessarily reflect in hours, right, the overall game sheet. But you and I know that they keep count on pressures, hits on quarterbacks, all those things, hoping to increase that throughout the game. And here we are in the fourth quarter. And now the Bills are going to stop it as they call a timeout. It's just their first. They've got two more to use here in the final stages. Game on the line, season on the line. They're going for it here on fourth down. They'll look to throw. And that's going to be incomplete. 12 seconds left. They had to go for it with such little time remaining. And that's going to be just about all she wrote for this one. And now out come the Bills. Only one timeout defensively, so this should just be a simple kneel down. I agree totally. I looked at my time management chart. It says take a knee, victory formation. They just have one timeout left, and that should be all, all she wrote. By the way, it's a good thing you can read that because nobody else can. <laughs> Not with my chicken scratch. Not at all. Well, partner, there's something special about a game in the snow. Just always fun in these elements, although a little chillier 